Hi everyone, this is Joy Banerjee from AI Carry Support and in this video we will see how we can uninstall a software from a remote machine with the help of PowerShell. Okay? So last time we have created a video on which we have seen that how to uh, check the installed software and how to remotely install uh, softwares to a, a multiple machines. So we have created both scripts and now I just want to check that how I can uninstall our application okay so let's say you can see uh, in this both machines we have an application called Adobe Acrobat Reader so uh, let me just uh, try to mark this and copy this okay so that we can target this one and uh, I just want to uh, remove this particular application okay so both applications are visible here you can see so we have a script and I just want to explain you about the script so what I've done is I've created a variable called app. Okay. So what we are doing is get WMI object, Win32 product, then the computer name, and where the name of that particular attribute we are talking about the property equals to uh, it's a Skype because I've tested with Skype. So let me just paste this here. So uh, <coughs> name equivalent to uh, Acrobat Reader DC. So then it will go into uh, this variable call, and then it will do a uninstall of the particular application. So uninstall this application. Okay. So let me try. <coughs> this is how it works. Okay. So I have not yet tested in remote machines, but I have tested in the local host. So <coughs> let's do a try. Let's give a try here. So <coughs> what I will do is I will uh, copy the same method here. Okay. So I will copy this at the top. And. Uh, I will repeat this and um, instead of uh, localhost I will be giving a server here <coughs> the server. Okay. so what it is going to do is it is going to call the content of the server the list of servers which we have in this txt file <coughs> okay so if we run this <coughs> so it will going to list the servers we have two servers here so now what we'll do is it will for each entries it will use this particular variable first entry from that particular list and it will try to check this uh, software is present and then it will do uh, uninstall okay so last time I've run that these are the applications you can see they are installed so I will wipe this out and try to run and see how it works so now I can see the script is complete okay so to test that what I will do is I will run this uh, run this script again so that it will check and let me know what are the applications are installed so previously we can see the Acrobat Reader was there so now I will do a quick check. You can see the Acrobat Reader is not there now. So it is uninstalled. Our script worked fantastic. Okay. So now if you can go here and check the Acrobat Reader is not present. And initially it was present. So um, this is a script. Just have a look. It's very simple, very crisp. So this will be helpful for you. So if this video is helpful, just hit the like button and do subscribe my channel. And uh, do share your comments if you want me to work on any other script for you. Just let me know and this was a query and a question from one of my viewers so I just want to uh, thank him that he just put the question to me so that I can create a video and which will be shared with everyone so thank you very much so this is Joy Banerjee signing off do subscribe my video for latest videos like this thank you